tucked among forested roads perched on the side of a river winding into the Paradise Valley, there sits a little historical shack. Trucks stacked with kayaks and fly fishing poles mark Fergie's Cafe with an X on this no man's land map somewhere outside of Brackendale. This place has been here for you know over 50 years. We've got lots of locals that still come here that were here when they were children and, and they come back here with just beautiful memories of coming here as a kid, fishing up the salmon runs and having the small little cafe cater out some lunches. Fergie's Fair comes with no advertising. This kitchen is completely fueled by word of mouth. Days here are always sunny side up, no matter whether the fish are biting or not, thanks to this homemade sausage, which comes up at 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. seven days a week here at the Sunwolf Resort. All of our sausages are made in house. We're just making sausages every week. Right now, like our top sellers are white wine, fennel and fig. We've got a chai chili, which is a really spicy one for the not faint at heart. And we've got such things as the Canadian, which is our new signature sausage, which consists of root beer that we make from scratch. Chef John Vance heats the pulled pork smothered in homemade barbecue sauce for Fergie's signature eggs Benny. Benny, not Benedict. There are no saints here, just carnivorous caverns to slip into where pork is treated for 10 days before taking a 12-hour smoke. My kind of cooking style is all home style cooking you know, from the heart, from the stomach. <laughs> Eggs come from a local farm right down the road. Greens from one farm further down. Grassroots describes both ingredients and John's talents, which arose out of kneading pizza dough with his dad, before stepping into formal kitchens in England, Vancouver, Whistler, and now Squamish. I drove up the valley to go fishing and saw an open sign, stopped by for a coffee, and took one look at the menu, fell in love with the place and the area, the surroundings, and haven't left since. And Mel's happily full, no one is complaining. Last year, Squamish Chief Newspaper readers voted Fergie's Cafe the number one breakfast stop in town. And the award-winning AM Pick also serves lunch as well. Going back to the pulled pork, we do our pulled pork sandwich for lunch. Back to the corned beef, we slice that thinly into a house smoked brisket sandwich. The food is as rustic as its surroundings. A tire swing eagerly awaits children. A snoopy old tree peers over picnic tabletops to look in on a lazy day of cards. And in the background, the soundtrack of the river is always calling, and not just to customers. I'll be kayaking this river all summer, born and raised fishermen, so on the salmon runs, always out there fishing. Leaving the fish to the rivers and the landlubber meats to the menu. From Brackendale, somewhere between Whistler and Vancouver, I'm Nicole Fitzgerald for Shaw TV.